I took one day off and I come back to see Ray from IVE is in some controversy because she is apparently stereotyping black people now. Let's take a look at the clip and form an opinion ourselves. So this is where I first saw the clip, but apparently it was on TikTok before. So Ray says it's a tan kitty. Hello kitty. And she put on some camo underwear because it reminds her of hip hop style. But then she goes on to say... So yeah, that in and of itself is questionable. So here are some of the reactions to it. Now, how did she manage to be racist with this even? The second she said Tan and Kitty, I knew it will all go wrong. That first half was kind of cute, but she kept talking. Love Ray down, but I hate how K-pop artists compare a little bit of brown on the skin to hip-hop. This person says, so she gets a tanned Hello Kitty and immediately starts with the hip-hop gang gang skirt, black racial stereotypes. Okay, weird. It was cute until she started that. She could have just said it was cute. This is why K-pop idols getting inspired by hip-hop always feels inauthentic. The first thing that comes to their mind is either harmful stereotypes or surface level cliches. So there's a wide range of sentiment here. There's some people thinking she didn't do anything wrong, and there's some people thinking it's flat out racism. So let me give my two cents on this. I don't think Ray is intentionally being racist or harmful here. What I do think is that she is stereotyping black people in a somewhat negative light, and I don't think that is okay. It came across a little iffy to me. The problem here is that Ray probably thought she had a good intention of portraying the Hello Kitty this way as a way to admire hip hop culture, but it instead came across as a little insensitive to the international audience. We have to remember that both Japan and Korea, and a lot of Asia for that matter, is very homogenous with objectively little diversity. So Ray comes from the least diverse place in the world, and on top of that, doesn't have much interaction with people of color. However, that being said, I don't think this should be blowing up as much as it is because it just clearly isn't as sinister as what people are saying. Is it a little uncomfortable? Sure, and I wouldn't be surprised if Ray came out with some sort of apology, but I also wouldn't be surprised if this just gets buried under the rug and nothing happens. I think it would be considerate for Ray maybe to just make a quick Instagram story post to address that she didn't mean anything harmful and she will avoid things that can be interpreted as stereotyping for the future, but I don't think it's necessary for some super elaborate apology like a statement from the agency. Overall, it's not that deep, but would be nice to get a response just for the fans who are more offended by this to have a little reassurance. Anyways, I'll see you guys soon. Have a good one.